This is the Farms.com Soybean Report brought to you by Dow Seeds. Dow Seeds, leaders in customer-first technology. Hi, I'm Lisa Prasic, Prasic Advisors. I have 20 years of big data analytics experience working with some of the leading technology players in agriculture. And I have the joy of having the opportunity to travel around the world and visit, meet with farmers, and hear about what's working and what they need next on the farm. So I'm here today to talk to you about four tips about how to get started with your data agriculture strategy. And the first tip that I would suggest is that you start by um, learning more about what's going on with ag data. You might attend a conference, you might look online at YouTube videos, you might um, go to New Ag Talk or some of those other locations or even talk to other farmers at the coffee shop. The, the second thing that you want to do is you want to organize the data as you have it already. So kind of understanding um, you know, where that information is, having it all in one place, and storing it off to a secondary location. Some of the things we talk about as the cloud, but you might look at a product like Dropbox or Google Drive platform for storing off that information. It makes it easier for you to share with advisors that you know. And talking about advisors, your ag retail partner, your agronomist, your crop consultants would be a great source of information for learning more about what's going on with data. So the other aspect is just that, engaging with your advisors, understanding what tools they use, what they might recommend, because they see a lot of farms just like yours. So kind of like, how do you stack up? What other information do you need uh, to make good productive use? The other aspect about this particular data is understanding what your um, seed and crop protection uh, companies have in terms of data about their seed traits or the fungicides, pesticides, insecticides you might need to apply throughout the growing cycle. So the, the last aspect that I would suggest is um, just really get started. Get your toes in the water. Try one platform. There's lots of platforms out there to help you start organizing the information that you have. So be it any particular platform, what's really helpful is if somebody else you know is already using one of those platforms, do you have somebody to talk with as you go along the path of trying out these new tools? So those are four tips on how to get started with using Precision Ag Data. So if you want to learn more about what's going on with Precision Ag Data, just follow me at, at Lisa Prasic on Twitter. This has been the Farms.com Soybean Report, brought to you by Dow Seeds. Dow Seeds, leaders in customer-first technology.